how are you welcome again back okay there is something new here okay behind me there is a milky way and sitting free mount and okay i'm wearing the cap okay this is focalista team cap indonesian organization for astronomy and this was given by my very good friend Kak Toye. Hi Toye. So he gave me this as a like a friendship and I'm proud wearing this because they are helping me in many things. Focalist Atim because yeah, somewhere we are like sharing um, our understanding here and there via Instagram. So you can follow them, Focalist Atim if you are in Indonesia or anywhere around the world. They are really helpful. They are really big. They have many astronomical events here and there, and they are displaying everything and talking about everything. So, and Kaktoya, thank you for this one and those Indonesian coffee. I really liked those coffee because of you. Now I'm drinking my own local made coffee too, and I'm promoting it. Really, thank you very much. And I want to thank Mr. Hakim, Hakim sir. He has been supporting me all the time um, in many things since I met him during 2013 in Asia program. After that, I have been contacted somewhere so so. But anyway, whenever I contact, he replied me and he suggested me many things regarding astronomy. If I have any difficulties, I will talk to him. Thank you very much, Mr. Hakim sir. Thank you. And today, today's main objective is. Um, I'm going to assemble simple CZ3 micro go to upgrade fit for um, yeah, CZ3 equator mount. This is Celestin Astro Master. Usually it uses the CZ3. And I'm going to show you how to assemble it. If you remember, I have shown before this one, these things. It's a micro go to things. Now you can computerize your CZ3 mount. No need any manual things, it can be automatic. Or with remote or even with the Wi-Fi so basically I think many people don't know about it because I have not seen myself the tutorial regarding this anything I had there is a website they had and this one I have printed from it but it's still here is not clear instruction for CZ3 it's for Shinta EQ2 this one but the rest of the guidelines is useful for Wi-Fi, how to connect Wi-Fi and how to connect with the computer. So you can read this manual also. But assembling, I'm going to show you how to assemble it. Before that, I need to connect under the camera and today I'm sure there will be no echo, uh, any sounds like previously. Finally, I solved that problem. Now, okay, let's begin our disassembling or assembling thing. But we need to disassemble something here. So. Okay, let's begin. I will connect another camera. Give me a second. Yeah. Okay, I see myself over there. Disconnecting. Okay, finally we, we have. Yeah. So, this is the CG3 here. Now you can see we have connected it now. And to the answer, no, no echo at all. Okay, before beginning, I will show you something about CZ3 here. And it will be here for about two minutes in my face, but you can see these things here. Okay, here's the part. I'm not really using moving that camera for a while. So, and I'm not connecting. Here, look here, something is here. Over this one, this part, look at the second camera now. 
Mm. Maybe I have a light problem a little bit. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> okay, that's sorry. I was in the wrong camera. Here, look here. This one. This part below, you can check it. You need to open this one. This is to connect motor. Our faster master we have under motor. You need to unscrew this one. We are going to put iron motor for a while. No, you, you, you can check here and there. It's not a problem. Here. Mm. Okay. I'm inclining a little bit. I hope it will not fall. Oh. Yep. Yes. Now it's quite easier than before. I'm rotating this one. Here you can see this part here. I want it unscrewed. Mm. This one. Yep, it's right there. Now I'm going to fit on it as cross motor for RA. This one is the R one here. It's like L shape or S shape, whatever you want to think. We need to fit it here. You understand that? Okay, I'm just facing it. I'm checking second monitor and this group instead of looking here. You just fix here and yeah, there are some screw you have to put tight. Hold tight for this in order to rotate in this way. I think I'll tighten this one. Okay. I hope the view is not blocked. Okay, this is done. Now the time is here. This one is a little bit tricky here, over here. I'm not putting any rod here. This one is a little bit tricky, but I will show you how to do that. So first motor is finished. Now we are going to fix this one. Yeah, you can check the second one. Now how to figure it? It goes here like this somewhere, here. Let's fix this one. For that, we have something new. One is here, this thing. Here, second, second, one, up here. So, there, when I'll open this, I'll show you how to connect it. Before that, this, this is the hair, gear over here. Look at the second, this is the gear. This will help for mechanism, access to tone. It's something really cool. It's special for CG trim out. Mm -hmm. Okay, first you need to open this one. One, two, here are three things here. You have to unscrew this one. I already unscrewed two of it. So, this one. So, now, let's check it. Okay. Don't forget we have something here, which is one. Yeah. This one and this. You need this one. You don't need this one now. You need this one. This is your second camera. 
And okay, now look here. This is the part here where you have to fix this one. Yeah, again, turning this off. Up, up, down, up, and up. Right one. And remember here, it's so easier to understand how to fix this now. This, this motor and this motor, both face in the same side. Okay? Okay, sorry. Yeah, both same, in the same side. And here the curve, this lies in this place. So here, the lift fixed here. So remember this, this will be up part and motor, both motor will be on the same side. Okay, here, these are step up motors, so be careful, this is a really good material, but it's 3D printing, it's like a plastic, but it's 3D printed one. The uh, rest of them are metals here, but these are, so you need to be very careful over here. Yeah, I'm fixing this. Up part, okay, look, it, it was perfectly. Did you see this? Okay. Yeah, you can see this here. Look, it's big. Hi. So it's fixed here. Now, what should we do? What this then? Yeah, this one. Do you remember this? Here we put. Look here. Here is two things you have to remember. One is like here is a face something. It's like a sticky. A sticky. It's normal. So sticky parts would be here below, and non-sticky parts would be top. Now you are fixing this here. Okay, come on. Hold tight. Okay. This was for this one. Sorry. Yeah. It should be tighter enough because it will hold the load. This is loading area. We have three. Okay. I'm sure you can see here. This mm -hmm. yes, you can take second window the second camera is fixed. No one lost that. It can be done in this way. You need to be careful here, but I'll tell you something here is uh, most important. Very, very important, otherwise you can damage this gear. Thread. This is this ohm is crew. This should be really tight, okay? Really tight. I mean, this this part because this will hold the load. This part will hold the load. This part here. There will be the another long rod, and there will be the weight. So it, it should be really tight. Otherwise, you might have some complication later on, or like accident things. Okay, I think it's enough. Yep. John, 
Okay, here is another one. You need to put full tight. This one. You can use actually this one for this this trigger. So yeah. And these tools are given by the seller about this kit. When when whenever you buy this one, you will get these things. Hold enough tight so that it is not movable. Okay, it's not more well now. Don't pull, pull hard because I told you it's a, you know, like plastic, it's 3D printed material, so don't uh, put too tight. So, okay, now we have fixed this thing. There is one another important thing. Yeah. This one. Okay, this here. Now look here, you can see something here. There is a home screw. Mm, wait. Look at this part, home screw, and here's the gear. You have to put that together. Actually, it's automatically fit here, but according to the instruction, the manual, you should not put tight. And look here, we have something this. This is how it works here. Just need to fix it. Insert here. And remember, don't put this screw with this tight, very tight. It may damage while uh, there is rotation. Light enough to touch the gear. If too much, it will stop here. There will be the problem, consequences. And most interesting thing, Lose this one. You can fix this this part. Declare this axis. Fix during transportation only. Otherwise, when you are using this one, you have to put this loose. Otherwise, your um, gear will be. I mean, this type of motor will be damaged. That's for sure. So I kept a little bit tight. Okay, it has not touched here. Okay, not there. Mm -hmm. Okay, down. It's not too much tight. I think this much will work. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it's not too much tight. I hope it's. So we have done now, we don't need to fix more things here. Mm. We have no need, we don't need to. So we are ready here. Now you need to connect those these cables. And okay, the adapter, the one, the adapter, you need to buy separately, this adapter you need to buy separately. This is 12 volt, 12 volt, here. This is a general recommendation from the supplier. Now, there are two cables, one for RA and one for declination. Okay, now I, I forgot which one is which. Probably this one is RA. You can check it when you are connecting it. Okay, now I'm connecting those cables. Here, 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 both side now. Okay, I'm connecting power. Okay, you heard a beef sound.
frequency here. This one. So this is normal with this mode. Okay, I'm having a little bit problem with power supply. Maybe this will work. No, nope, it didn't work. Okay, the blue bottom, there is west and east direction. Now you can check. It's so big that I cannot move the clients now. So you can lose this. This array, you can put a little bit fix. No problem at all. Yeah. Okay, I will show you the motor is rotating. Okay. Sorry for it. If you see here, look here, it's rotating. Again, look, 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 it's moving. Yeah, you can see it's rotating over there. Fine, it's working over here. Okay, reverse axis. Okay. Here is another one. So, you can take the whole part. There. This is here and this black is for that those is two parts. Can you see it's moving? Look, look over here, it's moving. Yeah, it's rotating. So it works fine. You can control this the uh, Wi-Fi too. And uh, for Wi-Fi I need to show you the application, but for that I need to use, to use another mobile or something. Uh, currently, it's not available for one because I didn't find for iOS, Android version free, any blind turn software. I'm using, I think, it's Sky Software Pro. Uh, the provider will provide you the software if you ask them. The customer support is really good, really good. Okay, it's working, it's rotating now. Yeah. Okay, now reverse. So you can use those software, Wi-Fi, computerized, I'm not done yet. I will do it later on, because this is the first time I'm assembling myself. Last time, last time I unpacked, I didn't get enough time. Now today I'm assembling myself, just now I need to check. But with Wi-Fi, it worked already, I have to check about that. 
also that later on <clears throat> wifi how it is controlled it's not good time it's cloudy today and it's really polluted in here so i'm not using any telescope so now here so r is not a big problem here the below the here with the load here okay uh, something is not complete here i'll bring a load for you to, to show you how it works give me give me no 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 Okay. Already ready. Now let's take the final for some of this one. It's really heavy. Actually, take all this and all this put this. I'm resting for a while only. Okay. Okay, it's long enough. Now look. But the problem here is whether it will rotate or not. Okay, declination. Hmm. I think I'll try to find it. This I don't have this overloaded here, so I am holding my hand here. Pull to that motor part. motor is moving i think the gear has a little bit problem So it's working very slowly after the load. No, you know how this go to telescope works. You know very well, yeah. So it's not a big problem. It's micro go to actually than go to. It can automatically track the planets from planetary software. I tested that with software only without using any telescope, and it works fine. Automatic tracking. You can control with this. and a remote or wifi you can control from their apps ios with planetary software that supports uh mid uh lx 200 which generic or classic 200 you have to set up that telescope mount i mean at mount you can select from planetary i will give that tutorial also later um it's not that much difficult but for now it's so okay. it's working we go so This is now computerized. You understand? It's computerized, really. I'm really happy with the digital mount that can be computerized. And this is only one gadget I have found so far in the entire world. And it is made in Ukraine. I mean, this kit are made in um, kits are made in Ukraine, and you can order from eBay, Astro Gadget. There are because I'm sure the supplier is only one over there, and. The customer support is really good. Delivery system is good. Now you can use. I never expect. It's like simple dream. <laughs> yeah, maybe. But it's a big dream for me. Really, it's a big dream. And I'm delighted to use this one and compress this digital mount that I never expected. And it will save you lots of money. You can practice with this now with planetary software for astrophotography. Uh, you can practice with this one and when you are good enough then you can buy some expensive one for better pictures or anything whatever you want to use now with this even you can put a dslr you can you need some extra accessories and you can have some terrestrial photography also whatever you like this is your computerized mount thanks astro gadget probably their name is astro gadget okay i will show you something about their site mm. okay this is already done so i'm mm, canceling this camera now but i don't know how to cancel it okay when i want now put it off so astro gadget okay this is their site so here are the pictures the kit 
but it was not in the manual. And they are true. It's hundred percent true that we can make it. This is their side, their descriptions over here. Uh, this kind of listen here. So their site is astro-gadget.net. So just go and grab it if you have discount. And it's simple, use it. Nice and have fun. Uh, what to say? Star hopping? Have a nice star hopping. Bye. Okay, once again, I'm stalking closing video. And thanks, Tara, for joining. I'm sorry, now I saw you now. Okay, I'm ending this video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Ah.